right back at it right back at it with another one the compounding factor everything in life has a compounding factor everything you do everything you think everything we believe compounds upon itself on a continual basis whether we understand it or not whether we see it or not the compounding factor is always there just like the momentum principle is always there you do a certain things enough over time consistently there's a compounding factor and there's a momentum factor today let's discuss the compound factor target team target team okay that's a real estate team in my other video my last video i was just discussing how to door knocking to prospecting to going out there every day and finding and building relationships with people leads to a compounding factor that it took me years to understand even though it was taught to me before other brokers mentioned it to me and i didn't understand it fully shout out to brandon Mulrennan. i definitely understood it when he he talked about the daily the power of, of 30 contacts a day and how i want to use that to build this business and my goal is to become a millionaire in the next couple years by that compounding factor but anyway everything we do compounds upon what itself you see a person might look overweight today they wasn't more, more, nine times out of ten they were not born overweight it's what we do in terms of eating and dietitian that compounds that leads us to have excess weight around our body right you eat McDonald's every day the first day you don't see McDonald's and, and the best the best vision of that of the McDonald's factor is the Super Size Me video uh, a documentary and this is from years ago this was from the early 2000s this came out when this guy ate like McDonald's for, 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 uh, for 30 days straight and the doctor by 30 like 20 50 three weeks in the doctor's like listen you gotta stop eating this this shit because <laughs> your health is not good and I think he did it the, the full 30 days but anyway you eat McDonald's the first day you don't see the results your body is slowly changing based upon what you ate but you don't see what's taking place on the inside but things are taking place on the inside and so you eat a burrito every day you eat a, a taco every day you eat pizza every day you are building something within you just like if you were and you see the videos where you do 100 push-ups every day and how dude's chest will be a lot like yo okay pull-ups every day yo i see that it's with everything in life saving money every day investing in in in, in whatever you're going to invest in every day it compounds it, everything compounds your relationships you you take care of your relationships you follow up every day every week and build these necessary uh, relationships they compound into fruitful engagements. The opposite is also true. When we don't do what we need to do every day, when we don't follow up, when we don't nurture our relationships, when we don't show up for work every day, well, you're going to get fired in two or three days. It doesn't take you 30 days. You'll get fired very, very much sooner than, than that. But I want us to just understand that and again, when I speak, I don't speak from a position of thinking I know it all. I speak from a position of what I've witnessed in my life based upon things that I should have done and how I'm looking back 10 years ago and I'm saying, this is where I could have been if I was consistent. This is where I could have been if I had used the, the law of compounding, because I, I believe it's a law, a universal law of life, if I had used the universal law of compounding in my favor to continually build upon this, my life could have been this. And this, you know, this goes into where we are where we are based upon what we did or did not do 10 years ago. Health, financially, socially, relationships wise, even divorce. I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong. Marriage is crazy these days. But nothing just changes the first day it's a you didn't have that conversation you didn't resolve that argument you went to bed angry 
whatever the case may be, compound it to where now that relationship is ending. So everything is a to everything is a compounding factor. And I just stress that because it's time we use these universal laws, which I want to study and I want to bring it to the people. I believe that life is governed by certain universal laws that you can't see, but they're always in motion. They're always working with you or against you, depending upon what you choose to do on a daily basis. And the law of compounding is one of those laws. I believe if you seek, you shall find is another one of those laws. But anyway, that's another video. So I just want to share some ideas on that because I'm thinking about my life going into 2024 and what I'm going to put in place to ensure my success for the future. So I appreciate you tuning in. I appreciate you watching. And uh, we're going to keep talking. We're going to keep sharing ideas and all that other stuff. Later.